हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू पीबी मैथ्स फोर पॉइंट्स ए बी सी एंड डी लाई ऑन ए सिंगल स्ट्रेट लाइन ईच आर वन मीटर अवे फ्रॉम ईच अदर एन एंड एट पॉइंट ए वॉन्ट्स टू रीच ए शुगर पार्टिकल विच इज एट पॉइंट डी बट देर आर इंसेक्ट रेपलेंट्स कैप्ट एट पॉइंट्स बी एंड सी द एंट वुड नॉट गो विद इन वन मीटर ऑफ एनी इंसेक्ट रेपलेंट्स then what is the minimum distance in meters the ant must travel to reach the sugar particle this question is taken from cat examination if you are interested to solve this question you can pause this video now and try to solve otherwise let's move on to the solution to find out which is the minimum distance ant must travel to reach the sugar particle let's first draw two semicircles of 1 meter radius at point b and point c in these two semicircles ant must not go so that it can save itself from this insect repellents and also let's draw two perpendiculars bx and cy in those semi circles now ant must go along ax xe ey and yd or ax xy yd to reach that sugar particle it has two roots now we need to calculate which is the shortest route to reach that sugar particle let's first calculate the length of ax we know that abx is equals to 90 degree so ax is the quarter circumference of the circle so ax is equals 90 degree divided by 360 degree into 2 phi into r value is 1 meter so 1 which is equals to 5 by 2 similarly yd is also quarter circumference of a circle so the arc length of yd is also 5 by 2 to reach the sugar particle and must travel through ax and yd that is fixed now the question is of reaching point x which path is the shortest for ant to reach there are two routes now for ant one is through directly x to y and another one is through xe and ey let's calculate both the distance xe plus ey and xy so that we can find which is the shortest distance let's first calculate the length of xy in this figure we can clearly observe that xy and bc are the opposite sides of rectangle we have the length of bc which is 1 meter so the length of xy is equals bc is equals 1 meter now let's calculate the arc lengths of xe and ey to calculate xe let's join be and ce now bec is an equilateral triangle in which each angle is equals to 60 degree we know that angle cbx is equals to 90 degree therefore angle ebx is equals to 30 degree now let's calculate the arc length of xe xe is equals 30 degree divided by 360 degree into 2 phi into the radius value is 1 so we have 30 and 360 get cancel we have 1 by 12 into 2 phi into 1 then 2 and that 12 get cancel at last we have 5 by 6 which is approximately equal to 0.523 similarly the length of ey is also going to be 0.523 therefore xe plus ey is equals 1. 0.04 meter which is greater than the length of xy 
So, and must travel through XY to reach that sugar particle with the minimum distance. So, the minimum distance and must travel to reach the sugar particle is AX plus XY plus YD. Lengths of AX and YD are 5 by 2. And the length of XY is 1. So, 5 by 2 plus 1 plus 5 by 2 which is equals to 1 plus 2 5 by 2. Here 2 2 get cancelled. We have at last 1 plus 5. The approximate value of 5 is 3.141. So, the minimum distance and must travel to reach sugar particle is 4.141 meters. That is the solution. I hope you got this solution. Thank you for watching the video.